here on the Colour of Country Life Flow FM. We're speaking with Jane Evans. Jane, your name's on this flyer for the Barossa Improved Grazing Group. What's this event going ahead? And good morning. Good morning, Ricky. Um, look, the Barossa Improved Grazing Group um, is an industry leader in the agricultural sector, and we're holding this. Um, meeting in partnership with the Anguston Agricultural Bureau to welcome all rural producers that have an interest in access to water security uh, moving forward towards 2050 and beyond really for our region. The purpose of it is to assist graziers, rural producers and industry leaders to have the opportunity to discuss regional needs for water security and identify expressions of interest with the proposed new water project that may be coming into our region um, so that everyone can better understand industry demand for water, quality, quantity and the price for access moving forward. Yeah, I know that from speaking to some local people there in that Eden Valley area, the water mains pipeline doesn't get terribly far past Anguston. No, that's right. Um, look, we have... Um, the, the, the region has been um, sort of approached from two different angles with um, potential access to water infrastructure moving forward. So the area that um, is the main focus is the Eden Valley region and um, that currently does not have any access to external water security at the moment. Um, We have some mains running up to the Eden Valley township itself but they stop there and I understand they're fully allocated. So we're looking at um, potentially um, increasing access to water security right throughout that region and the potential upgrade to... um, Raw water access from the Murray would be one option. Um, And the other option is um, access through the Bolivar plant with recycled water, with bringing that up through the valley floor and over to Eden Valley as another potential option for moving forwards. Um, And I must say that the um, businesses that are coordinating this is PERSA, um, has engaged this process with um, Kellogg Brown Root, a, um, a business that's also um, overseeing a detailed business can- plan for the region, and Barossa Great Wine Association are working um, with us and under other industry leaders to connect with rural producers in the area. And it could be a big boost for those rural producers. And what is the sort of c- proportion of those producers, uh, wine grape growers versus, say, cattle producers? Oh, look, I haven't got that at hand at the moment, Ricky, but I understand in a general sense, I mean, our wine producing area is so well known on a state, national and international scale. Obviously, the irrigators are the higher end users, but we also have about a third of our industry enterprises, I understand, are not grape growing in the Eden Valley region at least. So we have a range of members with the Barossa Improved Grazing Group and Ag Bureau Group that um, range from meat and wool production, sheep, lamb, beef, dairy, um, agricultural tourism, cropping, dried fruit production, contracting services and transport, and on it goes. So there's a lovely mix of enterprises in the Barossa. Um, Yes, predominantly grape growing, but well complemented by other uh, food and and, um, tourism. Well, for that broad range of producers, not just in Eden Valley, but on the Barossa Valley floor, if they're thinking they might benefit from connecting to this network, this forum that you're um, hosting, uh, where, where and when is it and how do you get involved? Yes, it's tomorrow evening, Tuesday the 9th of November, at the Zion Church Hall, which is 85 Murray Street, Anguston. It's a free event and it's running from 7.30pm until 10pm. And everyone is welcome, um, anyone with an interest in water security uh, moving forward um, because we're approaching a hot or dry climate, I think, in our future forecast. So we're trying to drop proof businesses and basically make financial planning a lot easier for the future for everyone. The current, the current rainfall situation is probably a bit beguiling in that front. This is building for the future. Um, on the flyer here, I think I've got an email address is the best way people can reach yes, you. Yes, that would be correct, Ricky. Thank you. Um, so it's Jane Evans, which is J-A-N-E dot E-V-A-N-S at big group b i g g r o u p dot org dot a u and that forum on tomorrow night tuesday night so get your skates on and get on the email get in touch with jane thanks for talking with us on flow today thank you very much for having me ricky it's an absolute pleasure